The next lesson we're going to do is painting. I'm going to split you up into pairs. Seth, you'll be with Austin. Maurizio, Slavko. Jason, with John. Anwar. And who's my partner? With Ricardo. Yeah! Great. I'm so excited. The guys on the right, I want you to go up on the stage, please. First five guys to go up, Christian gave them some props. And then he said, uh, gentlemen, drop your clothes at your feet. You <laughs> serious about this? A cap man has to be able to free himself of his inhibitions at a moment's notice. I had to know whether they could do it. Personally, I love being naked, so I have no qualms about it. When the models are in place, can you pay attention, please? Before Ricardo completely unrobes, he takes his prop, which is this huge-ass shield, and he puts it in front of him and continues to undress until he's naked. This is, this is Mr. Hung. This is Mr. Horse. You want to lay your down, black man? Oh, yeah. I'm a black man. I don't need to. I'm not self-conscious about my size. He's probably got a light switch of a penis. So he's a little bit nervous about showing out the world. Can you do me a favor? Just turn around slightly. Perfect. I got to be a new model, which was cool. That, that didn't bother me at all. Don't Woo! stop. These are dynamic poses. This is not a female, feminine, reclining pose. This is about dynamism. Roughly got the, the, the figure in the right position, so that's great. So if you look at Jason, it's a basic triangular pose. The pelvis is going to come halfway. The bananas are going to be bang in the middle. Putting forth the effort and, you know, I'm really starting to come alive as a kept man and growing as a kept man. I want to see broad sweeps, broad brush marks. You might not have to be an artist, but you need to have a little artistic ability. You're all choosing your own colors now, and that's nice to see. You're all expressing yourself in your own way. I gave Ricardo a little head because, honestly, I didn't want to focus that much on his head. That's where he puts all his attention. He's always looking in the mirror. He's always fixing his hair. He thinks he's so hot. I thought, in my portrait, we're just going to give a little less attention to that. Put your brushes down and get your clothes back on, please. You did really well keeping those poses. Thanks a lot. He's definitely not a shower, and I'm talking about Ricardo. The guy is a wimp. All talk, no action. Guys on the right, can you please take your places on the stage? Christian definitely was into the posing. I mean, I was just there to serve a purpose as a model. I've done it before. It's like breathing to me. We want dynamism here, yeah? yeah. So, twisted like this. Oh, nice. <laughs> You're looking up to the sky can for inspiration. The front so I can really push it out there? Or... <laughs> I feel but you're straining to the heavens, yeah? I feel dynamite right now. <laughs> Disrobe, and we'll go for the painting session. So I get naked, fully naked. I'm standing up there. Let's do it. They give me a harp, a little harp, and not even to hold in front of me. I'm supposed to hold this harp up in the air, you know, swinging. I don't care. Let's do it. I can see some nice classical poses here in front of me, and I hope the artist's going to do you guys justice. Getting paired with Seth was probably the worst thing that could happen as far as keeping things straight. Well, the spear, you should draw in first, because that's going to dominate his pose. No mucking about, please. He's serious about learning about art. Christian was telling us not to muck around, and I had Seth up there fully nude with the spear, busting out what colloquialists call the uh, mangina, and shaking it about and pulling it out. What are you going to do? We all got one. It's cool. Just give it a little tug, stretch it out, you party, you're ready to party. Can you please keep your poses? Seth. I'm fine. Seth was, you know, playing with his private parts and I found it quite distracting. But eventually, you know, he behaved himself. Excellent. So well confusing. spotted. Doing really well. Once I figured out that this art class was a challenge, I started getting involved. I was like, okay, this is going to be cool. I, I can get through this. I like the way you've got the posterior here. You, you're really getting that well. I'm definitely more advanced in the competition just because of my ability in my drawing and my cultured point of view. I think what being nude did for me was allow me to understand a little bit about what being the center of attention is for Jerry. 
I think the challenge was to show how we were going to react to that when we're the center of attention and if we were going to run or if we were going to stand there and take it and be able to deal with the pressure. I stood there, I took it, I dealt with the pressure. Put your brushes down. Can you get your clothes back on, please? Thank you very much. Lesson was over. We had our clothes back on. We thought we were done. Our friend Katie walks in. This evening, real art critics will come in and view your artwork, including Jerry and some of her celebrity friends. My cat man has to do more than just create art. He has to be able to appreciate it and discuss it. This evening, your paintings are going on the auction block. My initial reaction is I'm going to get sent home. I think by far I had made the worst painting of the group. I definitely wish that I paid more attention and asked more questions while I was like, either I'm going to be embarrassing myself or I'm going to go out with a bang.